Ohio took its ninth straight match win Saturday night as they defeated the Western Michigan Broncos in three straight sets. And that moves Ohio into a tie with Bowling Green after Bowling Green defeated Toledo tonight at the top of the MAC. In set one, it was all about the Ohio attack. They had 22 kills and just 36 attempts. In four errors, that puts you out to a 50% attack percentage. They were just really on fire in that set, and it really showed they won that one 25 to 19. In set two, it was more of the same as Ohio really jumped out to an early lead, 7 to 3 forcing a really early Western Michigan timeout and unfortunately for the Broncos that didn't do much for them as the as the Bobcats finished that one 25 to 18. Set three was a significantly closer affair as Ohio's attack sort of fell off a little bit they moved only to 23 percent attacking percentage and and they were actually out attacked by the Broncos who went 18 to 47. However seven errors really hurt the Broncos in that set and Ohio was able to pull out a victory in that one, 25 to 23. Chelsea Bilger played one of her best games of the season tonight. She had 16 kills on just 26 attacks and one error. That's a 58% attack percentage. And it's really hard to stop this Bobcat team when their outside hitters are playing as well because Kelly Lamberti also tipped in 14. Here's Coach Tice talking about the performance of Chelsea Bilger. Yeah, she was great for us uh, offensively. She was getting a little frustrated with blocking. Uh, I thought when they brought in 17 Askew, she came in and did a great job off the bench moving the ball around. And that was frustrating our defense, but I was really pleased that it didn't affect Chelsea's offensive game. She kept scoring, kept scoring. It was almost like she was fighting back point for point with that kid, and, and that's what I was so pleased with. I think I just came in feeling good, and you know when you feel good, you just play good. The Bobcats will square off against rival Miami on Friday, so of course the Bobcats are going to make it out to that one. And then Saturday they host BG, and that was that's a team that beat them earlier in the year in three straight sets. Not a lot of the teams can say that about the Bobcats recently, so that's going to be a big one. Be sure to follow us on Twitter at Bobcat Showcase, and of course at wub.org slash showcase.